So what's going on everyone and you may recognize that I'm actually not in Malta right now I am currently here in Catania in Sicily I'm here for the long weekend tomorrow we'll be filming in a restaurant quite close to here so this evening I'm gonna just get around explore Catania Saturday we're gonna go to Mount Etna one of the most active volcanoes this side of the world just gonna enjoy this trip and see some good food so today it wasn't actually all that smooth of a run I woke up this morning and this happened Ashback. so what's the first thing you do after six and a half hours sleep it's 6 45 in the morning naturally you reach for a coffee so I get up I turn the kettle on everything's great spirits are high I know I'm going to Sicily in a few hours coffee is gone but don't worry, I made a cup of tea and tea is pretty much the exact same as coffee. I mean, you can barely tell the difference. Mmm, oh my god, it's, it's literally identical. This isn't an ideal start to the day, but the day is going to get better for sure. So, technically this is good because now the day can only get better than this. End of flashback. But after that everything was okay, we got to the airport pretty quickly. that door over there. So now with the sun is setting here at Catania, I'm just gonna walk around, be a tourist for this evening. Get some work done hopefully on my laptop just so it frees up the weekend a bit more for me. There's actually, there's the cricket match on behind me as we speak. So that's the current situation, the place. I already love this place. I'm telling you, anything that is Italian related has something close to my heart. I just love it. Not only just do I love the food, but I love... I love lamp. Do you really love the lamp or are you just saying it because you saw it? I don't know, the, the atmosphere, the surroundings, the people. The weather, everything is just fantastic. So another crazy busy weekend ahead of us. We have the filming tomorrow. We have Mount Etna. We have other beaches we need to see. Just kind of soaking all this in as much as I can and um, just enjoying life. Currently on a 35 minute stopover in Nicolosi on our way to Mount Etna. So if you ever are here and you are planning to do this, it's like a good idea to get the bus on itself instead of a book tour, 35, 40 euro for a trip and it doesn't bring you up Etna, it just brings you to the base. Whereas this bus was 6 euro, it'll bring us to the base and then we'll pay for a cable car to the top, which will be 40 or 50 euro. So you're paying the same price, but one you're going up the mountain and the other you're going to the base. So you'll see more throughout the day anyway, but that's the plan. So yeah, today we're just going to the most active volcano in Europe.
think it's the highest point we can go to without a guide. But you can see from behind me that is Mount Etna, that is the peak, you cannot go up there. Because this is actually active, like this could blow at any second. This is like the main viewing point. We've probably been walking for like two, two and a half hours, but the roads are really, really good. It's all kind of pathways like that, so you're not really, it's not really strenuous walking. A lot of it is uphill and the ground is quite loose, but it's quite easy to walk on. It's absolutely amazing, I mean, the views are just incredible. So I just brought things like an apple, banana, two protein bars, and then a packet of rice cakes. So constantly I just have carbs. Snacking on them, not really filling up too much, because I cramp up. Lots of water. So that is just a very, very quick and simple workout to do. I just want to start by saying you can see the sunburn where I was wearing sunglasses yesterday. But that is just a very quick and easy workout. I looked this morning for a gym and uh, it's a Sunday. It was like 8 a.m. so there was no gyms open. This is perfect. It's just like a small little jungle gym. Get a little bit of a sweat, a little bit of a pump. Just gets the muscles working again. Because it's going to be a lot of traveling today, a lot of sitting on buses, sitting on airplanes. So I want to just start my day right and even though this isn't like a proper workout or anything that I will be doing usually, this is like the best way to start your day. So I'm going to have plenty of energy for the rest of the day. At least I know that I've gotten my workout done and uh, it's a great way to start your morning. Oh. All right. Okay, so as you can see, we are back in Malta once again. There wasn't much to fill up on the way home. It was your typical day of traveling from buses to the airport to waiting to the plane to home and then just kind of fitting back into normal schedule again. Another amazing weekend spent traveling abroad. Sicily, you were absolutely beautiful. Tanya itself was a gorgeous city. We also... <clears throat> Jesus. We also went to Taormina on Friday. I'll play some images or videos over here now. Taormina is further north than Catania, but it is an absolutely beautiful town and village. A little bit more old school than Catania. See more of an old school Italian vibe. Another city ticked off the list for us, and that's the last trip I'm gonna do for two months. Because then in two months, my time in Malta is finished. It is going absolutely insanely quick and I've gone from counting the weeks I've been here to counting the weeks I've left. Once so we wrap up things here in Malta, we get on a plane and we travel the world for two weeks before we get back to Ireland and just continue and just keep growing, keep working, keep getting into new ventures, new ideas. So this space, this community is going nowhere. It's only going to get stronger, I promise you. So as always, thank you so much for watching. I appreciate every single click, every single view on these videos. If you're new here, Hit that subscribe button, join the familia, and let's grow this community into something bigger than I ever thought it would be. So until the next video, keep on cooking. Ciao, ciao.